Let's see if she likes it. And if you're really good, Kevin, I'll let you have some too. Mm -hmm. That is what your kitchen looks like when you've been snuggling these guys. Oh, oh why are you wet? <laughs> why are you wet? What happened? Did mama lick you or did you get pee on you? Either way, I don't care because you're too cute. Mm -hmm. You're too cute. You guys, this is why we do this. <laughs> you know, originally when we started um, getting baby goats or getting goats in general, it was just for milking them. And then, well, then you get this and it's just, you know. Hey. Hey. I'm coming out and saying hi to baby goats. But I decided that it's more important than dishes Good. or cooking dinner. Oh yeah. So, I guess you better think about dinner. Okay. Oh. It's just so fun. This one is so snuggly. Oh yeah. He's my favorite. Boys I, are always The boys your favorite, are always my favorite. And we can't keep them because they don't make milk. Oh, maybe we just keep them instead. <laughs> huh. Well, you guys have given us really good names. So in tomorrow's video, we promise we'll tell you the names of all three. We're gonna decide tonight. Um, and we'll tell you the names of all three. Okay. Okay, so one thing that I like to do when my goats deliver is to give them like an herbal mixture. And let me show you what I give them. Look how organized I am. Kevin, do you love how organized I am? two different herbal concoctions post delivery. The first one is just a milk boosting blend. It has fenugreek in it and dill and fennel in it. It's supposed to help boost lactation. You don't just like regularly give it. You just kind of do it during this time when we want her milk to be highest. So I put a little bit of molasses in it so it's not so herby tasting. And let's give it to her. Hey, I got something for you. Does that smell good? Hey, wow. Well, she likes molasses. She's my molasses loving goat. Let's see if she likes it. And if you're really good, Kevin, I'll let you have some too. Mm -hmm. oh. She loves it. She's mm -hmm. sucking it down. Is that nummy? I guess that means you really need it. She's the best goat. She is the best goat. Is that nummy? Let her chew on it. <laughs> She's gonna take yeah. it off. Okay, there you go. Good girl. I always chew Good holes. Girl. So that should boost her milk. I get it from Molly's Herbal Mixes. Anyway, just a fun little holistic thing to do, and it really does help. So that's gonna be today. Later on, towards when the goats reach one week old, we're gonna give all of them an herbal dewormer. So we'll wait a little bit and we'll do that. So, Kevin, remember forever ago when you didn't want us to have goats? Nope, too long ago. Now you're happy, cause, yeah. right? Because we get to have these baby goats. Yeah. Your life is complete. Pretty much. Well, they, so we've locked all the other goats up. We're obviously still milking Luna. Penny, Mabel, Tilly are all in here right now because we don't want them even next to the fence over there. Make the babies nervous. Where Doris is. Make Doris nervous. Yeah, they might stuff. headbutt against the fence, try to hurt the babies, and it'll just really agitate Doris. Did you turn it on? I think so. But yeah, I can't really hear it. I swear it's not. Oh my gosh, that was it. Turned it off. That was it. Oh my gosh. So the garden has been drier than normal and I go out there and I've been spraying it and I'm like, I wonder why the timer's not working. It's because we had a new filter installed. Yeah. Now it is. Oh my gosh. I, I thought I was going crazy. I thought I was going Where insane because I was like, I swear the timer is set correctly. Two weeks ago or something. <gasps> oh my gosh. 
Yeah, that's nuts. Well, good thing you, I wouldn't even thought to do that. I would have been walking back and forth to the garden a million different times. Well, now it's finally watering. I was wondering why everything was looking really dry. <laughs> finally fixed it? Yep. Was it even watering at all? No, it wasn't. Oh my gosh. Oh well. Yep, this was it. So we installed a Radiant Life filter, a whole house filter, about a month ago and we wanted to see how it is before we really talk about it on our YouTube channel. We love it, it's amazing. That was the problem when the guy installed it, he turned off my water to the garden. So the whole reason I got this is so that we could filter all the city water. We would have all the water in our house be filtered from fluoride and chlorines and chloramines and all of that. And so I was really excited because I was gonna do like our cooking water, our bath water, our garden water, our water for our animals, like our whole house would just have this clean water. And in the process, <laughs> the garden hasn't been watered for a month at the raised garden boxes area, not the other area. Oh my gosh, that's what happens. Life. Having baby goats is like having a baby human. It's like all life stops so that we can take care of them. But it's getting late, so I'm gonna go and make dinner because we human people still need to eat. got the chili finished. I added more dishes <laughs> to the dishes, but we have success because we have baby goats and that's what the most important thing is. Um, and we have delicious chili to eat tonight. So we're gonna end the vlog for tonight. So say bye guys. See ya. See you later.